there can be no peace without development no development without peace and no lasting peace or sustainable development without respect for human rights and the rule of law good evening everyone my name is shivani thaplyar from dav pg college and i am going to express my opinion on one of the very crucial and potent right that is no discrimination everyone in this world have human rights that must be protected by the law according to united nation there are 30 basic human rights recognized around the world and i am going to express my opinions on no discrimination discrimination means the prejudicial treatment of different categories of people on the basis of race caste sex or disability no discrimination is necessity because it is incumbent to maintain the dignity of every individual recognition of no discrimination means that before everything humanity is there as before any gender religion caste or sex we all are humans and humans are meant to be empath not ruthless if we talk about india maintaining no discrimination here is a big challenge itself because india is a country of many diversity and diversity is not always an aspect of acclaim gap between rich and poor is a seed of hostility inequality between men and women is depraved and predilection for a particular religion is onerous challenges are meant to be challenged with this mentality our indian government has done a commendable job with campaigning like beti bachao beti padhao and the results are in front of us this time the sex ratio of india is in the favor of females for every 1000 males we have 1020 females yet the psychological barrier is here and there has been a discrimination and it could not just wipe out until each and every individual try on their emotional level to get this prejudice out of their head we have to relinquish these differences in order to attain our no discrimination goal and this is not something incorrigible well all we need to do is debilitate the jaundiced eye mentality and the most efficacious method in my education because education provides knowledge and knowledge makes a man unfit to be a slave it doesn't matter if the discrimination is big or small it in toto abysmal so i would at last i would like to say that every human being is born free and they are equal and uh, equal in dignity and rights they are endowed with reason and conscience and should react with each other in the spirit of brotherhood thank you and have a nice day